Hello, everybody. It's time for some more Fireman Gage. That's right. As much as I would love to continue the story, you already clicked on this, so you already know what is happening. It is time for a paralogue. Leaf's paralogue, to be specific. A place of significance to Emblem Leaf. Here, the Divine Dragon will face an important trial, just like all the other times we have. What do you got for us, Leaf? The Sage Lord. I didn't even know if that was your title. Honestly, never knew. Something about this place is really off. What do you mean, buddy? Leaf moment. It appears to be the River Thracia. Quite similar, at least. Is this some place in your world? In looks, it is quite close enough to a stretch of ground where I once stood. The River Thracia was a beautiful, broad river. And it was the site of much bloodshed. I see. Dude, playing these paralogues, like, just makes me so badly want to play the old games, dude. Localize them, Nintendo! I can't imagine some place as serene as this turning into a battlefield. You'd be surprised. This is where I faced the genius tactician, Sias. Some thought him a hero. But others thought him as a trashy unit that you can only get in <laughs> as a grail in heroes. Reinhardt, a powerful man said to be the crusader Throod Reborn, was there as well. Reinhardt, the funny man. It was a difficult battle. Many were the moments when I thought defeat was at hand. So why does this place look like that? I do not know for certain. I sense a mighty force emanating from here. This must be the trial appointed to you. A uh, trial? <laughs> a trial? It's not like we've had to do those before or anything. I want you to fight me here. Okay. If you overcome that trial, our bond will grow stronger. The bonds. That bond will bring with it power we cannot do without if we are to survive the battles ahead. Okay, well, I mean, we could do without it. Honestly, all the paralogs are optional, but... Winning a battle against you is my trial? Understood. Alir <laughs> knows he's the worst emblem. <laughs> Good. Victory is your only way forward. It's so sad because, like, you think about the core and you think about the core emblem and like how broken she is, and then you look at Leaf and you're like, what does he even do? Like, you get weapon triangle mastery, but only when you're engaged, and like quadruple hit isn't even that good. He's just like, he's just not a very good emblem. I hate to say it, he's definitely just not that good. I honestly have seen people say that, like Olwen herself. The, the bond ring is just straight up better than emblem leaf. Anyway, we got a ballista here. Uh, three uses it looks like. That doesn't seem so bad, but we gotta be careful not to send our flyers out there. Or if we do, use them as bait. Okay. Lots of people over here. Lots of fortress knights to be specific. Uh, oh, what the heck? These guys aren't even promoted. And then like right behind them, they have like level 10 promoted. What the heck is up with that? You have unpromoted units here and then just like a bunch of, that's weird. That's so weird. I don't know what's up with that. Okay. Well, there's three unpromoted units there. Uh, this doesn't seem that bad. Lots of ballistas. And then Leaf is chilling up here with... Oh my gosh. That's a lot of mages. Oh, that's a lot of mages. Oh, and they all have Thoron? Ew. Ew. That's disgusting. Oh my gosh. Oh. What is that? Was that in Trap? Oh, it's silence, thank goodness. Oh, it's all silence. Okay, yeah, all right. Looks like the the ending uh, is probably gonna be a bit rough. Meteor, wait, what the heck? Why do you have Meteor? Why do you have Meteor and Fracture? What's up with that? Can they trade? Uh, that's weird. As for Leaf, he doesn't really have anything too special. He's got his weapons. The Light Brand is obviously a little scary because the magic attack. He's got that quadruple hit, which will also be scary against our flyer units. Adaptable exists, arm shield. Vantage plus and then unbreakable. Okay. I wonder is this supposed to represent like Sias then? Maybe, but then who is this? And like would these are these supposed to be like Reinhardt and his goons, maybe? I don't know. Lots of deaths over here, which looks weird. This honestly seems like the least threatening part of the map. Hmm. Well, there surely might be some reinforcements. Lots of ballistas. Yeah, this is a very anti-flyer map. What the heck? Yo, why do they have such like Good rewards that well magic tonic is whatever, but like that seems really weird. I, I guess these are supposed to represent characters from the game. Alright, this is a really weird and like spread out map, but like we're just gonna do our best with this one, I guess. I don't really know what to expect. I think I'm gonna go in with this team. Nothing really too different. I did slap uh who is it, Sigurd onto Diamond this time because I don't actually have cancer on Diamond. And I have heard of a strategy of using Rider's Bane and Override onto all those mages. So I'm excited to see if we can maybe pull that off. I think that'd be pretty cool. But anyway, it's time to go. 
Here we are. Hi, Leaf, and all your Thoron users. I will stand my ground. No running, no hiding. Now, come at me. Alrighty, let's do this. The question is, what's the gimmick? <laughs> That's the biggest thing, because every single paralogue... Yo. Let Yo, this theme already going so hard right from the very start. That's what we like to see. Okay, lots of unpromoted units here. I'm honestly a bit confused. That seems so weird. Like, why would they have unpromoted units okay. this late into the game? When they say, yes. like, oh, you should be this level, why throw, like, such easy people? Maybe this is just supposed to be, like, an easy paralogue? Shall we dance? I don't know. Some I paralogues have honestly been easier than others. And uh, knowing Leaf, his status being the worst emblem, maybe he has the easiest paralogue? Who knows? Uh, th again, there could Shall be a we? funny gimmick, right? There could be the funny gimmick. And the blisters, they're not exactly going to be easy to deal with, but I'm sure we'll find a way. For now, though, this music is beautiful, dude. I've been going back and listening to all, like, the Trial of the Blank, which is, like, you know, Trial of uh, all the Paralogs, basically. And, wow, what the hell? Oh, I guess I have to go through the force. Never mind. I was setting my army to go around. Either way, let's see what happens here. Uh, pardon? Wait a minute. Are they trying to escape? But I need those. Wait, what the heck? Why are they heading to the right? Let's see. Ooh, I can't kill, unfortunately. Yeah, I can't kill any of them. Might need a bit of a repo chain. Hold on. If I can get my dancer over there. Sea doll. Hold on, double, double repo should do the trick. Here we go. Repo, repo. Schneer them. And then I'll be able to double dance. I just want to see. Something Something is just fishy. Something's fishy about those guys. Moving over to the right, especially since they all have all those nice items. I would like to see if I can snag some of those for myself, you know? Oh. Oh, this music is so pretty. The fact that, like, dude, this game is just so... It has so much, like, callbacks and, like, fan service or whatever. It's such a good game, dude. Oh, my gosh. Like, if you're a Fire Emblem fan, like, and you have been a long-time fan, like, there's no way that you are not, like, popping off over all this stuff. Alrighty, Alchrist. Unfortunately, does not seem that you can snag this KO, but if I go Brave Bow, this gives you four chances for Luna, but you might need two of them. I think if you do this, you only need, you probably only need one Luna here, but I feel like I want to give you more chances for Luna, right? I think more chances in this scenario are better. Let's see here. No, no Luna, no Luna, no, no Luna, and there's the Luna. Oh, and a Luna crit! I'm still alive? I think the Brave Row was definitely the option there. There we go. We got some speed taker shenanigans. Send that magic tome back. I unfortunately cannot reach unless I engage. And is that worth it? Probably not. Oh, the ballistas are gonna go kind of ham. Uh, yikes. Well, hmm. I think we just uh run up. Honestly, I think I can engage. Honestly. Yeah, we can we can get back Lucina by the time we have to fight Leaf. I have Bo Evo, I think, built in. Yeah, we just do this. We just straight up do this. Here we go. Evo plus ten. We go boop. And then boop. That easy. I'll change the future into hope. That's right. <laughs> and we got silence, okay then. I'm just worried about more about Alchrist as well, because Alchrist, he won't be able to take those ballistas as easily. Thank you. I could totally be just being stupid here, dude. I could totally be making a mistake by overextending this much, but whatever. Oh, and Sigurd movement, too. I might just have to restart from turn one, depending on what happens here. I feel like we're just about to get bought by these ballistas, but let's just find out together. Here comes ballista number one. Oh, that does huge damage. Ow. Well, there's, there's, Alchris is super dead. Uh, sheesh, I underestimated these ballistas. I didn't think they'd have a 100% hit rate. Jeez, okay. What about on a Leer? Oh, that's on Seedal. Wow, those hit hard. Those hit way harder than I thought they would. Oh my gosh. Okay then. Hmm. And what is that? Another fracture? Dude, what the heck? They want us dead. All right, well, obviously overextending was maybe not the best idea. All right, that's fine, I guess. Interesting. But like, why are these guys running away though? Like what, what's the deal? Okay. Why are they running though? I don't get it. That just seems so weird. Uh, I'll play it a bit safer this time. Let me let me start from the beginning and just try and run up and bond and shield. So I kill that guy turn one, the silence user. And now I'm up here. 
But I need to be able to get to this guy. That's tough. And they only have a pure water, which is kind of useless, but like... I just feel- I have a weird sneaking suspicion that I want to kill these guys as early as possible. And I don't know what it is. But I feel like... I would like to- I, honestly, that guy probably won't even come for me. I can actually kill with a Silver Axe here. Let's do this. All the way down, buddy. Fair fight. We go, boom, and boom. There we go. Nothing to fear. <laughs> so broken, dude. Oh my gosh, that's so stupidly good. Okay, I still get hit by, is that two ballistas? No, that's, oh, it's potential for ballista, okay. So only one ballista can hit Diamond. That's good to know. I'm stupid, I could also obstruct them. I'm so dumb, dude. I'm, dude, I forgot I had all these engages in the back to go big brain, and I just like keep forgetting about all these big brain strats, dude. It's over, all I have to do is obstruct those losers. Cause look, it's a three space. And obviously, Fram and Micaiah can affect three spaces. Those blisses are still trouble though. Still very much trouble. That's just annoying. Ooh, freeze though, oof. That's not good. Did not know they had freeze, okay then. Looks like it's gonna have to be uh, Micaiah here to do some shenanigans. Obstruct wall. <laughs> And since we, since it's like a huge obstruct, thanks to the uh, staff range plus one, look at this. Look at this, dude. Ooh hoo hoo, so good. We still gotta make our way down there though, cause they can break it. This sucks. This definitely sucks. Uh, cause bonded shield was kind of my way out of this. So now I don't really know what to do about it. And I'm almost certain, let's say I bonded shield here. I think the freeze stays. It's not like heroes where if I like were to sing or dance to him, I don't think it would refresh the the freeze. I'm pretty sure I'm just still frozen, which is kind of dumb. I wish dancing would refresh it, but whatever. That has an L wind there. That's kind of cool, I guess. Huh, I really want to stop those losers, though. I really, really want to stop them. Thank but you. those ballistas make it really hard because they hit like a truck, and I didn't know that guy had freeze. If I, if I knew they had freeze, it'd be much easier to deal with. But alas, I did not. We'll have Yunaka run down here and then always just go for her little bit of funny moments. Yeah. Let's just see what happens here. Obviously, I'm silence proof. Here comes you. Oh, that's fine. I'm dodging, dude. Oh, okay. Never mind. <laughs> I'll get hit by that 8%. Not a big deal. Not a big deal. Here comes you after Yunaka. Wow. Why is the hit rate so good? Okay, dual guard moment. See, that's what I was going for, that dual guard there. I can't believe they have such high hit rates, though. Something's off. Are Dublissas add, like, 100 hit or something? They got to. They literally have to. There's Fracture. Annoying also. I don't know. Ballistas? That just seems odd. Silence moment. Because they have those specifically there, right? To make it harder. Yeah, see? I was hoping that would happen. Thank goodness. Those guys come in. All right. Huh. Well, obviously, run up bondage shields, what we have to do with Aaliyah. I'm not frozen anymore, which is good. But I gotta make sure I don't overextend to the point where my party members aren't left behind, you know? Do this again. Free. Obstruct them again. That's all we can do for now. Uh, five plus eight should take care of you. If not, I'll take a little damage. Here not the go. end of the world. There we go. Yeah, not so bad. The question is... Okay, that hurts. I'll put you right here. Cause I'm pretty sure that's just potential. Oh, actually it's not. Oh, that's dangerous. Ah, <sighs> why are their hit rates so high? Oh, I see. Plus 15 attack and plus 80 hit. That's why it's so troublesome. Okay. I get it now. I get it. So Hortensia has been silenced, but that doesn't mean she's out of the game completely. She can still do the funny dance. I could move down here with Diamond, but that is, that, that's, that, that would kill me. <laughs> that's, that's asking to be killed. Unless I bonded shield, but there's no way. I can't make it down there with Alir. And also stay safe at the same time. This sounds loony, but I'm gonna start with this, I think. We'll bring Diamond down all the way over here. Will this kill me? Maybe. We'll find out. <laughs> we shall find out. Ooh. Let's go, dude. God, please protect us. Two EXP. That's so depressing, but they are of an unpromoted class, so it makes sense. And there we go. Lance power. Not that it matters. Ooh, I can even canter. Is it worth it? Maybe a little. Uh, honestly, yeah, because then I can... Uh, I still can't bonnet you. I'll have to... I'll have to just kill you with a Leer, I think. Yeah. Actually, maybe all Chris here. Hold on now. Silverbow. Yeah, we'll one-shot you. I know I know. I have so much EXP with him already, but whatever. And dead. <sighs> I just don't want to get doubled up. Because getting doubled up would have hurt. Like, heck. Get speed taker as well. 
but Fogato there. Louis unfortunately cannot come down and repo, but Tamara can repo. I'll see doll. Then I can dance to Alir. Your hit rate is 143. My Avo's 141 or 151. Yeah, I think let's run up bottom shield. Am I dead? Maybe. We'll find out together. <laughs> I think regardless, this is going to hurt. No matter what happens. I just hope they go after Diamond. They're going after Saline. She's dead. Well, that's cool. <laughs> Those ballistas hurt like a truck, dude. Oh my gosh. Okay, so Saline's not in range this time. Let's see what happens. You're going to go after Yunaka this time. She'll live. It's funny how she has so much Avo and she's still... It's the, the hit rate is still so broken. Why, dude? I didn't know the hit rate was so good. Okay, well, Dual Guard came in clutch. Can it come in clutch again, though? That's the question. The question we all want the answer to. A boop, let's go. I can't run down there and kill them either, which sucks. Even if I was like to warp, well, warp Ragnarok, nah. I don't think what warp Ragnarok would kill. This is actually a bit tough. Getting past this per first part. Cause we have to kill one more guy, but Diamant ran out of his uh, Sigurd. So he wouldn't be able to run backwards. Hmm. There's still two Ballistas. I have one more turn of Bonded Shield, but like I still have to take two to the face. And you come up. I have to kill one more guy. That's just the issue. One guy short. Hypothetically. Oh my gosh, that does nothing. Wow, that does nothing. Also, strange to note, these guys are stationary too. These archers? That seems really odd. All right, I do have an idea. It's gonna be pretty risky though. It's a run and retreat strat. We do this, kill this loser, and then we run back bonded shield. Lily, we gotta stay in the same spot, get that pure water gone. So we're safe there this turn, which is good. That silver axe is gonna hurt, but we literally have bonded shield for that reason. Boop. And then next turn, and then we're gonna have to come down, uh, we're gonna have to rush up with these two. And actually they can step just out of the range of the ballista, I think. I think we might just barely make it out of this. Huh. Yeah, honestly, I think we'll be okay. These guys coming in are scary because they all have uh, a bunch of breaker skills, but uh, that's fine. We're chilling. Oh my gosh, I could have just, I just realized I could put Sigurd on Louie again. Done the old fashioned Sigurd and Louie strategy. Cause like how much damage do they do to Louie? Nothing, he's got 48 defense. They have what? Let's see here. 44 attack and they get 15 from the Ballista, putting them at 59. So they'd only, be do, they'd only be able to do 11 damage to Louis, meaning I just kind of shove him out here. Let's just see what happens here. Going after Diamond probably. Yup, as expected. The bot and shield moment, let's go. He can't even get hit by the other one because we have a bot and shield up. And well, let's see, boop. Bot and shield, let's go. We're fine, dude, we're actually chilling. We kind of cheesed this first part. Bonus shield again. Oh, double hit. That sucks. Brave sword moment. Oh, well. I did not know that guy had a brave sword. Probably should have checked. I could have traded shenanigan, but whatever. All right, you guys are losers. Who cares? Oh, wait, they just froze a leer. Oh, no. Oh, no. They just froze a leer. Uh, okay. Hmm. How do we deal with something like that? These guys are coming in. Huh. They froze a leer. Okay, can you guys shut up? <laughs> that's a lot of reinforcements. Oh, that's bad. That is bad. Okay, well, let's start with this. And then we can repo a leer, I guess. Repo, but then what? I'm still stuck. Wait a minute. What, what if Chain Guard saves me here? How much damage are they doing? They're doing a lot. If I put Tamara here and then Chain Guard Tamara, they might try to go after Tamara here. Oh, but I also put her in the range of you, don't I? Oh, no, I don't, because I obstructed. Let's go. Okay, this might save us, because I might double up some Tamara, not realizing that they, uh, not realizing that the chain guard exists. That might save us. Well, no, she has more defense than Alir. They'll probably want to go after Alir. And the freeze also gives us minus Avo, right? I'm pretty sure. Oh, no, it doesn't, actually. Not in this game. I'm pretty sure freeze in some games gives you minus Avo. Okay, well, we'll give this a try. Will it work? Doubtful. Oh, Diamond's Dem still in range. Oops, I forgot to put him out of range. Uh... Actually, Diamond might be... No, he's probably dead here now, this turn. I'm stupid. Yeah, they're just gonna go after Diamond. Oh my gosh. So many little things, dude. They're gonna go after Diamond. Yeah, he's dead. Gosh dang it, dude. It's so annoying. Oh, it's so annoying. Why are these things so strong? Jeez. Yo, leave me alone. There's so many reinforcements. 
Okay, well, I have a word. There is a word for chapters like these, everybody. There is a specific word. That word is tedious. <laughs> Not hard, but tedious. Here we go. Yunaka has less defense. Still doing the chain guard strategy. This guy can't reach. Let's hope they double up on Yunaka instead of Alir. If this doesn't work, I'll have to use up a ton of resources to do a double repo chain. And it's not going to be pretty. Let's see what they're going to go for. They do go after Yunaka. Let's go. The strat worked. It worked. And now, that's the, th the most important thing is that they're out of their Ballistician uses. Boom. I'll take the 42. Let's go, dude. Thank you, Chain Guard. Oh my gosh. That was annoying. Yeah. Not even hard. Literally not even hard. Just tedious and annoying. Yo, double freeze? Stop debuffing me. Oh my gosh. I have to be able to get to these guys coming in. Yo! <laughs> oh, this is annoying. Ah, uh, yep, that exists. Okay, so Louis is stuck here, but can you canter after freeze? I need to test this. So I probably can't do anything here, but can I canter? I, I, I haven't actually tested this. This is, a, this is a good time to test for the future. Let's see. You cannot. Okay, you cannot canter. That sucks. This sword bro has sword breaker, which is fine. I'm just going to put Aaliyah right here, and he'll be ready to dodge. Everybody else needs to just rush in this turn. Tamara... You can... Wow. Wow, what the heck? Why is her hit rate so bad? Jeez, Tamara. I thought you had, like, okay dexterity. Yeah, your dexterity's good. What the heck? Why is her hit rate so garbage? I guess it's this guy... It's just this guy's Avo. Why does he have such good Avo? What the heck? His speed's not even that high. Where's all that Avo come from? Bro, I want some of that. Can I have some of that Avo? <laughs> I already have plenty, but still. I like having Avo. All right, come on, Fogato. I have faith in you, buddy. You got this. Boop. And see ya. There, yes. He's getting so much EXP. We need that. Seedal snags a level up. He gets, honestly, your best stat. Honestly, that's all you really need. You need, like, HP, speed, defense, and res. Because you never really attack. Poor Saline is just stuck there. <laughs> she can't do anything, dude. All right, I think it's time. After all these losers stop spamming on us, which is going to happen once they run out of uses. I think they're just spamming whatever they got now. They're just going to spam freeze because they, they ran out of stuff. So just don't don't freeze Yunaka, please. And that's fine. I'm chilling there, dude. I'm not moving. I'm setting up a wall right here until all these guys are done with. Oh, wow. That's a really good hit rate. What the heck? I'm a Leer. I'm the Dodge Master. What the heck? Wow, these guys got so much hit rate, and there's a lot of them. And the question is, is there more? Yeah, there's more. Well, the good thing is, all they have are silver weapons, right? Yeah, it looks like they all have silver weapons. That's fine. That's fine. They'll come to an end eventually. They don't have Void Curse. If they had Void Curse, we'd be in huge trouble, dude. Huge trouble. Because then that would mean they're probably infinite. But for now, we're doing fine. Also, this map is so pretty, dude. Oh my gosh, it's so beautiful. Okay, once I put up the Unaka Fog, then we'll be good to go. We'll be good. Am I? I'm silenced. Rip. <laughs> they also only have one range weapons, which is really helpful. It's wall in time. Now, yep. We're cheesing, dude. We're fine. We're chilling. Boop and boop. Dude, it doesn't matter. We are chilling now. We have achieved wall. Now all we have to do is keep wall, I guess. Honestly, I think for this uh, chapter, I'm going to pass the longbow over to Fogato. Fogato needs more EXP, so if he can get, like, these chip hits in here, uh, well, if he can get these chip chain guards in here, that'll be good for his EXP. Let's see what happens. You're going to go after Yunaka for... Yeah, I figured. You'll never hit her, dude. You'll never hit her. Yeah, there's going to be a whole bunch of these guys, but we don't care. Look at that. They're not even attacking us. The only time this would become an issue is if Leaf and friends started coming down. Are they going to Are they gonna start coming down? I probably They probably won't because they got these Ballasticians for a reason. All right. Enough. Enough, dude. That's a lot of reinforcements. Jeez. Is this like what happens in Leaf's game? Is it just like seven? What was it? Eight. Yeah, that's seven turns of reinforcements. Jeez. Leave me alone. <laughs> is it nice that they're all like one range? Yes, because now I can snipe them like this. But it's still annoying. Okay, Hortensia, chill. Enough of those crits. Sheesh. Also, we have Thoron now. I forgot about that. I should actually try and use it on you. Yeah, you are annoying. I'm going to start Thoroning you. Here we go. Oh, Ignis Thoron? Boom. That was amazing. 
Let's go, Saline. That was awesome. Ah, Radiant Bow. It's the thing that is, it has my most damage output. Might as well go for it. Oh my gosh, it's so free. I can come right here and they just can't even attack me. All those, all those freaking uh, clerics used up all their stuff. So I can just hit this guy for free, dude. Oh my gosh, that's so broken. That's just free EXP. We're still chilling. They're not even gonna attack. Okay, they're gonna, the, only the sword user can attack Yunaka. The swords have the best hit rate. But besides that, I don't think they're gonna be able to do much else. They're all gonna start funneling in, but what, what can they do? We got our ultimate tank squad set up, dude. Now the question is, will there be more? Turn nine reinforcements. Oh snap, they finally ended. And it only took, wow, that actually hurts like heck. What the, oh, that's that's because of sword breaker. I was like, huh? What? What's wrong? Why, why am I sucking right now? It's that sword breaker, dude. But this is honestly just a EXP farm for Fogato. Cause he is level 10, right? He needs Here levels more than anybody else on this squad. Oh, and this impressed. is literally just his EXP farm, dude. Let's see if we can get this Thoron kill. I wanna see it. Show me the Thoron kill. Oh, Ignis again? Nice. Beautiful. <laughs> and she's just like, uh, I had to kill somebody. But hey, that's a thousand gold right there, dude. I will take that. Aw, oh, snap. It's Diamant level up time. What does he get? Strength, okay, good. I'm at least happy about the strength. Unfortunately, his the rest of his stats are kind of mid. That dexterity is good for getting soul though, but honestly, dude, Diamond, he, look, look at him. His stats are just like, he's okay. I really wish he was better, dude. He honestly just feels like he needs like plus like three to everything or just something. Like if he had like five more strength, you know how good he would be, dude? Ah, uh, I just want to use Diamond, dude. He feels like a unit that should have a lot more strength or something, but like, he's just not quite there. Oh, wait, they're back. They're back, dude. Oh my goodness, they're back. Any uh, void curse? No void curse. All right, they gave us one turn break of these guys. All right, well, we're in for the long run, I suppose. Boom, gets another Fogato kill. Hey, there we go. That level up, dude. Level 11 now. And the speed, dude. I think Fogato is probably... I think just from bases and growth, he's probably the fastest unit. I can even punch. I can't do much damage, but I can at least get Makaya back this way. Oh, that Ignis dude is so strong. Going after Yunaka. We're chilling again. No 8%. Ooh, left at one. Perfect for Fogato to pick up the kill, dude. This is literally just Fogato's EXP paralog. This is no longer Leaf's paralog. This is literally just Fogato gets EXP, the paralog. And uh, lots of calves as well. All right, um, you gotta end sometime, right? This is just getting a bit old. Also, I love what, how the game has started putting breaker skills on all the oh, units the that have, dragon. let's go. Oh my gosh, the rare Aaliyah crit, dude. It's so cool to see. What I'm trying to say is like, look at this, ax breaker and then lance breaker. All, anytime they have weapon disadvantage, they just give them the breaker skill. It's just to make them better uh, when it comes to that freaking weapon triangle, dude. It's kind of annoying, but whatever. Not so bad. There we go, pick up the kill. The Indeed he did. But it's okay because you still get EXP regardless. Tamara can finally kill this archer. There we go. How a princess does it. Yeah, now I can punch the freaking this loser and just get my entire thing back. Oh, strong bond, let's go. Now I can punch you to death, let's go. <laughs> It'll take forever because you're in a freaking tree. But who cares, Diamond will help. It is time. It's happening again, dude. It's just the same freaking thing over and over with these guys. We just gotta wait it out. Hopefully. Ah, uh, look at them, dude. Look at all these calves. So many freaking calves. Ah, oh, stop. This is too much. That's a lot of reinforcements. Uh, we can finally kill the sniper. Here we go. Ah, uh, sandstorm. Let's go. And honestly, since Tamara and Fram are still level 11 compared to uh, the rest of our cast who are mainly level 13, I'm just gonna be spamming with them. Hopefully they can get some EXP here because they deserve it. All right, so I'm sure this is gonna be kind of boring. So honestly, I'm just gonna keep whittling these guys down. And uh, if they keep on coming in, that sucks. We'll just have to keep advancing slowly but surely. But I think until they stop for good, uh, I'm not gonna show it because you already know what I'm doing. I'm just gonna keep whittling them down, giving all the EXP to Fogato and slowly but surely taking them all out. Any more this turn? We're about to find out if there's more this freaking turn. Please, let it be the end. Okay, what turn is it? Turn 13, alrighty. Well, 
Let's keep at it. Okay, we know it skipped the turn, but will they come back this turn? Let's see. Please don't. Please don't. Oh, okay, that's two turns without reinforcements. I think we're good. I think we're finally in a spot where we can say the reinforcements are gone. Thank goodness. That sure took a long time. So that'll get another level up and not bad. You knock a level up. Aw, snap. Level 33? Magic? Why? Stop getting magic. What are you gonna do with that? <laughs> oh, snap. Alir, how about you show her what a good level up is? Yeah, that's not bad. Defensive level up. Let's go. You know something I forgot? I completely forgot about Hortensia's ability, dude. Or I guess Byleth's ability, I should say, because it's just that Byleth is on Hortensia. I could be getting an EXP boost because of mentorship. So Fogato normally gets like uh, early 10s from when he's getting these KOs. Like anywhere between like 11 and 13. So now with mentorship, he gets 13. Okay, well, I guess that's a little more. Seedal gets yet another level up and it's not bad. I've now reached this freaking loser. And I though I can't hit, but at least I get something here, and that is pure water. Wow. I like how I can get a pure water from a Wi-Fi spot. Yet I had to do all that chasing that guy from earlier. Just to get one of those pure waters, dude. Yeah. Alright, here we go. Tamara level up time. She gets level 12 and not bad. Alright, strength and speed. I'll take it. Hortensia level up time. She's gonna get. Magic in res. All right. Well, I appreciate the magic. Her magic is honestly, surprisingly, not that good. <laughs> there we go. That's actually perfect timing. It took her forever because they were all in trees and they were so hard to hit, but Fram gets a level up to level 12, which is very good. Slap her here. Gets L Thunder. Not bad. Not bad. And there's only one of these losers left, so... Oh, dear. Bye, up break. It's fine. I was worried about that, uh... 11% hit rate, because knowing my luck, I'd probably get hit by it, but we're okay because the break. Ah, uh, Silverlands will definitely do the trick here. Finish the last loser off. Boom, and dead. That was fun. Oh, jeez. Reinforcements for what? Like 12 turns? It is now turn 23. Now we can finally enter in the second section of this map. And I'm sure once I hit this person, the entirety of this thing will come charging in. So Diamant has to get that Sigurd ready, dude. So I'm gonna start bringing everybody around. I guess mainly Fram. I'm nervous because look at all these deaths. Surely something is gonna happen here. I don't know what's gonna happen. What the heck is this, hold on. What is this arrow thing? Oh, okay. Oh, without moving. Huh. Well, okay, that's just a I mean, this is the worst certain blow. All right, let's see what happens. Anything? Yep, they're coming in. Are are the thorn users coming in though? That's it? That's it? Really? Okay. I mean, we just chill. Do the exact same thing we're always doing, I guess. Yo, I can do so much damage to you. I guess this be, uh, again, this is also a non-promoted unit. We got to remember that. This is a non-promoted unit. That's why I'm, okay, well. <laughs> Sandstorm is also why I'm doing so much damage, but Tamara never does this much damage. Actually, hold on, I forgot. It's because Erica. Dude, it's because of Erica. Because I use your own defense against you. Yeah, 31. I use that defense against you. That's what it is. Okay, I'm dumb, dude. Look at this. I can just straight up kill you with Hortensia. Free. These guys are so oh, no. easy. I just don't know why they're not promoted. Like, you have generals right in front of them. Why not make these guys promoted? I don't know. This feels like a paralog that's just like meant to give you EXP, honestly. That's honestly the vibe I'm picking up. I'm not even joking. Get this loser out of here. Does it. Yeah, look, that only gives us two EXP, but at least it's on a unit that doesn't have a lot of EXP right now. Poor Fram behind everybody. <laughs> Let's see what happens here. Okay, the Ballista might be able to go after- wait, hold on. Oh, that's- that's Diamond. Okay. I was nervous for a second there. Okay. I was like, why is Louis taking this much damage, dude? After you knock a- yup. That's fine. That's literally fine, dude, because I can destroy you with a leader next turn. Uh, let's get behind me triggered. That's fine. I dodge. Oh, I'm sorry. I mean, I smack that thing. <laughs> smack that arrow straight out of the sky. And we're chilling, dude. Dima is the don't only worry. one really at risk, but we could just heal him up. I don't know why I did that. That was a really oh, bad idea. Yeah, because now I'm at 6 HP. That was a bad idea, but at least I can heal. We're fine. Yo, I just got double sandstorm, though. That was kind of hype. Catch this Thoron, loser. Here we go. I'm here. Can I get an Ignis, though? Ah, no Ignis. Ah, oh, well. Easily kill this loser. But I probably should be giving it to my lower EXP units, but I just want to get rid of these archers. Something about them just 
puts me on edge, you know? Archers are pretty good in this game. Anyway, give me your 2 EXP. Thank you. <laughs> no, it's impossible. Louis only has 39 defense, dude? That means this guy has more base defense than Louis. What the heck? Actually, just comparing stats, this is literally just a better Louis. Dude, this is just a better Louis. I have buffs and he's just genuinely better. What the heck? And he's three levels below? That's silly. Anyway, we're fine. Yo, you finally triggered Soul Diamond. I think that's the first time in the entire map. I've attacked you so many times. Your Soul Trigger is a one in five and you've only triggered it once this whole map. That is some bad luck, dude. Oh, I can do so much damage to you. That's so crazy. That's literally all because of the funny Erica. I love Erica's Lunar Brace, dude. That really, that helps me cut through armored units so well, dude. Oh my gosh. It literally just reminds me of using Brave Erica and Heroes. It's not even a joke. 50-50 if this kills. Why is your hit rate so bad, Diamond? You have a personal skill that is literally... That literally increases your momentum, and yet you can't even... You can't even hit. What the... Oh, I'm stuck. Uh, it's okay, we have repo. It's all right. Big brain, dude. Big brain. Accidental big brain, I won't lie. Accidental big brain moment. Attacking Diamond, that makes sense. Poor Diamond can't do any damage to you, but it is basic. We're basically fighting a Louie here. We have to we have to realize that we're basically just fighting a Louie. Don't crit Yunaka, please. Of course. I don't want you stealing the EXP. Come on. Well, that's fine. It's not the biggest deal, but... I just want to spread out the EXP, you know? Gotta get those EXP on my weaker units. I say weaker, but they're literally only like a level behind now. I've been leveling up like crazy. Like, uh, Tamara's level 12. Fogato is almost level 13, which means he's almost on par with the rest of us. The only person who can be here is a uh, freaking Ballista. 14, we have to pretend you have 59 attack. You definitely will not kill Fogato. You can't double. So I think I'm fine to just go for a Radiant Bow here. Oh yeah, let's do that. Oh, wait, do you have a spear? You do. Well, gotta double heal you then. Oh well. Oh no. That hurts. Oh no. <laughs> Even he realizes he's in some trouble. Oh, I just have Kanto. Cantor is free. Cantor is so free. Actually, we could kill. Oh, because we have true damage. Let's actually kill with Diamond here. Come on now, buddy. I believe in you. You put up a good fight. Nice. Let's go, dude. Level 13 Diamond. All right. All right. Again, would have preferred strength, but speed and defense is never bad. Now we must be very careful about approaching. I'm gonna step in that tree, only 10 bog fragments. I was kind of hoping for some EXP. But we gotta be very careful of the Ballista that we're gonna have to kind of bait here. Let's see, Ballista, they are gonna attack. Okay, who? 41 on Yunaka, gotcha. Boom, big hit. That's fine though. We can always take one. The, th the thing is there's only one and I'm gonna be cheap because we actually have the opportunity to be cheap. 10 bond fragments, rip. What about here? 10 bond fragments, okay, no EXP unfortunately. Let's see what happens here. Gonna go after Hinaka again. Wow. I'm even in a tree and my hit rate's that bad. Or your hit rate's that good. Jeez, that's kind of crazy, dude. Let's see if Tamara can get EXP here. Gosh dang it, dude. Well, you know what? It's fine. Now that Tamara's in the fort, we start baiting down the other uh, Ballistician. And we kind of just chill for four more turns because I honestly don't want to have to deal with this. Who in their right mind would ever actually, you know play fair against a Ballistician and not just wait it out. We're chilling. Last guy, or last ballist, uh, Ballista thing. There we go. Now Yanaka's chilling. And this guy, here we go. 42, and Fogato lives. Wow, he almost died, dude, sheesh. All right, looks like uh, Leaf Squad has still yet to come down. It's so funny that I'm in a fort and I have my Iron Lance and I still can't dodge. <laughs> All right, but that's your last use, boom. You're out of uses. Now I can kind of just go and attack you whenever I want. And I'm going to bait these losers down right here. They have lots of range, but if I can kind of like coerce them right into a row, I'll be able to destroy like a ton of them right in this area uh, in a very, very good choke spot. Uh-oh. Now, destroy the bridge. Uh, okay. That's fine, honestly. Um, uh, cool, that was, I guess that's your gimmick, but like, uh, who cares? We're already past it. I think I cheesed this. I think I, since I killed those I guys so early, I think I was probably supposed to run over and chase them all the way down over here. But uh, by the time I beat them, it wouldn't matter. So like, then like every time I would try to come here, oh, I see. I don't know, I, I guess that, that's hard though, because like, who would not just wait right here? 
Who would actually go? Because there's like so many reinforcements. I don't know, dude. Ready for a fight. I have no idea. I'm just gonna just keep going. I have no idea, dude. Seed I'll level up. Eh, that's fine. Defense and speed is nice. Oh, now they're coming down. All right. Should have expected this. Oh, and leaf too. Hmm. Okay. Well then. Uh. What about this? Yo. What about this though? And a thousand gold here. Hmm. I guess I'll just have to trap leaf. Yeah, I'll have to trap leaf and then send every everybody else up to go and kill these losers. But they are pretty strong, honestly. Huh. Well, no one ever said it had to be easy. Right here. Block this off with obstruct. Just so they don't like run super far in, right? There we go. Cause I want them to all like kinda wall up like right here, so I can just like <laughs> I can just use Rider's Bend and just go shnirum and kill like I don't know, a lot of them. Hopefully a lot of them at least. That's the case that I should probably get rid of this person as quickly as possible. A Thoron plus Diamant should take you out. There we go. Three EXP, that's fine. And Diamant, yeah, you got this, buddy. I have faith. There you go. Nine EXP, wow, so, so cool. <laughs> it's not that much. All right, everybody else just prepares for battle. This is honestly gonna be pretty rough for Louis specifically because Louis, uh, he's gonna have to go up against a bunch of magic attacks here. Oh dear, they're coming down. And yep, come on, more in line. No, no, I won't be able to be funny. You're not in a line as much as I would like you to be. Well, oh, oh, whoa, 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 four, 54? Sheesh, dude, that's a lot. Okay, uh, this is dangerous. It's not really a one space choke point, is there? And once I override, there's no coming back for Diamond, dude. Yo, but what if I just ran away though, hmm? What then? <laughs> Mega obstruct wall. I don't really know what my plan is here. This probably makes them less than a line, but uh, I don't really know what else to do, honestly. Look at that, dude. I have a huge fortress of ice that I gotta go through. Bonk. <laughs> oh, they're coming around now. Oh dear, didn't think about that. Well, maybe that works out for us. Huh. Okay. Well, Leaf is still there. I'm just worried about that quadruple hit. Here's what I do. Let's set up an, let's set up two obstructs. Two five obstructs, I think. I just wanna get to a spot where I can go for like the funny safely. I really wanna use this funny. But the fact is that it's hard to do with Leaf being in the back, you know? Go. <laughs> go, my final obstruct. There we are. I still don't think the funny's gonna work out as much as I would like it to, but we'll see if we can make it happen. <laughs> what if I sent all Chris back over here with the longbow? Oof. Uh, I'll, I'll have him chill there, why not? Let's just see what happens here. I don't think I'll be able to go for the funny because that, that, that leaf quadruple hit just hurts so bad. I wish I could though. Watch yourself, buddy. All right, now is the time. Okay, nice. Oh, wait, hold on. No, oh, thank goodness. I was gonna say, now's the time we don't want you to get Luna's buddy. Strength plus one, okay. Eh, that's whatever. Defense is nice. That's fine? Oh, they're not even, okay. Uh. Well, they're still kind of in a line. I just need Leaf to come down. Oh, hello. Oh, uh, this is fine. 36, wow. Ouchie. <laughs> I don't even know you'd be able to hit Louis. Oh, can you double up on Louis? Hold on now. All right, Leaf is like all the way down here. That's good. So now what I can do is I can probably kill all four of those losers. It won't be the grand funny like killing 10 people as much as I would like to, but four should be good enough. Let's see here. Override, Rider's Bane does pick up the kill. Here we go. Go, Diamant. We only get four, but it's worth it so that we can actually live afterwards. <laughs> oh, it's so beautiful. It's so beautiful. Oh my gosh, that's so beautiful. I, I really wish I could have got more, but I don't think it's possible. Not in this mode. That quadruple hit is going to hurt so hard, dude. Oh my gosh. Rider's Bane does get the kill. I think I'll go for this. Come on, Louie. I believe. Here we go. Yes. Let's go. My apologies. Although you're still probably going to die because where the heck do you go? You can't even move backwards. Bad play. Bad play. <laughs> Wait a minute. What if I disengage and stop him? I, I feel like I'm doing this a bit early, but whatever. We'll do it. Ouch. Don't crit me, Leaf. 
Here we go. Allow me. Boom. There we go. I just want the debuffs on him. The debuffs will help because I'll take like 16 less damage from it. Because quadruple hit has four hits, right? So, a quadruple hit now only does 35. Let's go, dude. Because his attack is debuffed. Look at that, dude. We debuffed this so easily. And now I can... Ooh, okay. One damage is all we need. Oh, okay. Or Demon. Oh, Demon. Oh my gosh, dude. I just realized something. <gasps> That's so stupid. Dude. Dude. I just realized something. That's so stupid. The follow-up with Sigurd. He can attack from like anywhere. <laughs> Oh, that's so dumb. That's so dumb. All right, you'll never hit Tamara here. Let's do this. 10 times two. Sandstorm. Dodge. Sandstorm. Nice. Can let Fogato snag this kill here. Radiant Bow is all we need. Not that I'm pretty sure Silver Bow would do it more. Oh my gosh, Diamond. That's so funny. Okay, here we go. Level 13 Fogato. More speed, dude. You'll love to see it. Okay, I'm going to slowly try and walk around Leaf. That might sound weird, right? But I want to get him in a two-space choke point, if possible. And slowly just keep debuffing him, I guess, until we can get to a point. He might go after... Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Master Lance. Watch that. And again. I actually get for 12%. Oh, that's so bad, though, because now I'm killing him. It's over. I don't want to kill him. I just want him to stay still, dude. I should probably get the silver dagger off, then. And, of course, you can hit. Watch yourself, Yunaka. Pair up. Nice dodge, okay. Huh. That match lens is gonna be annoying. And here comes you. This is why I can't go up so far, dude. Because this guy is in the way, which sucks. All right, uh, we gotta find a way out of this. 39 damage. Give me an order. Okay, I think we come right here. After a heal, we definitely need to heal. Oh wait, we can heal afterwards because we have Hortensia heals. No, do not Dragon Bane. Let's go Iron Dagger for much less damage. This is better. I still do a lot more than I wish I would, but it's something. We gotta debuff him somehow, dude. And keep him there. Can get rid of this loser with a leer. This is all the Thoron users gone. It's good. Now, I might want to start obstruct walling Leaf, but I also have to take care of these guys, but I just really want all the rewards that these guys have to give. And the issue is I have to walk through this person first, which kinda sucks. Ooh, I wonder, hold on. Let's see, are these guys stationary? Let me see. Ooh, they are. They are stationary. So you know what I could do? I could run up and kill that guy with Warp Ragnarok. Oh my gosh. End this a bit earlier, huh? Here I come. Warp Ragnarok. Oh, no. I want to stand adjacent to you. <laughs> Warp Ragnarok. Let's go. Yes. <laughs> Get this loser out of here, dude. Boom. <laughs> Yo, imagine Warp Ragnarok canter, dude. That'd be stupid. Oh, that'd be so stupid. What about Asha Storm afterwards? Asha Storm plus Warp Ragnarok? Oh, come on, dude. Really? No, one Luna. One Luna is all it takes, surely. Come on. You got this, Alchrist. One Luna. Just one. I, I believe in you, buddy. Oh, you got you got three of them. You overkilled this loser. Nice. Oh my gosh, that guy is gone early. That's so good. Understood. Now look at this. And come up all the way up. Oh, that's so stupid. I don't think I want to do that, though. Because there's that 1% crit. And honestly, you're going to be tough, but... I, I, why? why? I, I still don't know why this guy has Meteor and Fracture. Like, what? what's... Oh, is that just like a reference? That has to be a reference, surely. Because I have no idea what it's about. Let's see what happens. All right, Leaf is doing funnies. Watch yourself. Okay, that's scary. <laughs> I am a bit nervous regarding Leaf. We should be okay. So I can run up to a certain spot, aka right here. Go ahead. Yunaka can come up here and probably try and kill you. This is fine, yeah, because if we have double obstruct, we can just keep Leaf away forever. And that's fine. He won't be able to get his silly quadruple hits off. Oh, I can get this kill with Tamara. Let's go. Here we are. One, dodge, no dodge, and two. There we go. Very nice. Yeah, I'd get destroyed by all this, dude. I can't do anything here with Diamond, unfortunately. Poor Louis seems to be stuck a little bit as well. Here we are. Comes up and goes for the clone. That's what I was hoping for. So there's another clone right there, and I hope he goes for that clone. But I also want to obstruct him as well. Yeesh, that's scary. But if I hide beha if I hide back over here, I can obstruct one spot, and he's, and he's in his two-spot choke point. 
That's fine. We're chilling, dude. Only thing is I might need a few more obstruct staves. I'm gonna use up all my one obstructs. Look at this, dude. <laughs> I have so many obstructs that just like, I, I, I can't bring into like main maps, so I can use them now. Use up all my obstructs. Well, after, well, actually, maybe not this turn, because I have to move you knock out of there, but I can use it with uh, Hortensia, probably. I want to see some big brain plays, everybody. All we got to do is bonded shield, and it's free. Bonded shield enemy phase, and put our pals in range. So, Diamant, you can come right here with that Tomahawk, and then probably Tamara here with the Javelin. And yeah, we're chilling, dude. We are chilling. Oh, wait, I can also start hitting them from far away. Well, let's do that too. Why not? We got the we got the Here tools go. to do so. Might as well. <laughs> We're beating them, dude. We're cheesing this chapter. Enemy face time. Here they go. Thoron, we got by the shield or dodge. Either one works. I think that's the only one with Thoron. So the rest are just yeah. They got strong spells, and we're dodging. Wow. There we go. Another soul. Thank you, Diamond. Are you gonna go for Diamond? Yep. There's a leer. Nice, dude. Oh, okay. Well, that's fine, I guess. Leaf going after clone. Nice, nice job, clone. <laughs> Good job, all cursed clone. Oh, come on. I, <laughs> I wanted that Ignis, dude. I really did. All right, Diamond, surely. You can hit this, right, buddy? Come on. There we go. Well, yeah, it didn't even matter. Didn't even matter. Uh, honestly, I think I'm going to out of the way because you're already level 13. Tamara is the one. Who needs these uh, freaking attacks now, dude? Sandstorm, ooh! No dodge, that's fine. And another Sandstorm, wow. Sheesh. Looking good there, Tamara. And ooh, we got the funny sword from Erica. I guess Louis is gonna be stuck back there for a while. <laughs> I'm gonna play a little risky, I think. I'm gonna go for the javelin. I probably get hit here, right? I'll probably get hit. Here we go. But I have bottom shield, so who cares? Sandstorm, ooh, nice, dodge. Dodge, 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 dodge. Nope, that's fine. I got bonded shield, dude. Okay, who's next? I either have to dodge a Thoron or bonded shield, and the chances of that are pretty high in my favor. Let's see here. 39, dodge. Nice, we got the dodge. Let's go, Samara. Leaf does come around. Oh, he goes for it. He's doing it on a clone, dude. <laughs> I feel as if I have known you for ages. <laughs> That's what you say? What the heck, Leaf? That's what you say to a clone? I feel like I've known you for ages. Sheesh. All right, can I step here? Yes, I can. Oh, snap. It's my turn, dude. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Go, Fogato. Dude. Now I'm the funny. I'm the funny now. <laughs> oh, that's amazing, dude. All right, we're going to destroy this person this turn. Here we go. I'm not sure who this person is supposed to represent, but... I imagine it's some character from Thracia. I mean, considering we're doing the Thracia thing. All right, Tamara, grab this kill. Here we go. Javelin, whatever. Boom. That's one life. Big EXP, that's what we like to see. Level 13. All right, I'll take that. Again, strength would be nice, but that was a good level. Can't complain. Cannot complain. Now, is anyone else not level 13? I think all of us are like level 13 and above now. That's good. Well, not really Sea Doll, but he's fine. He dances and gets EXP for free, dude. Oh, Diamond just destroys you, dude. Let's go. Diamond moments, dude. I'll go first. Yes. Okay. Nice. And dodge. Nice. Good job, Diamond. A battle fit for Brodia. That's what you like to see there, buddy. Thousand gold. See? See, dude? That's what we need. And we still can get the rest of the thousand gold. Oh, dear. I already forgot. Who's the cannon ring holder for Leaf? Let's do this. Honestly, I have no idea. I genuinely have no idea. You'll never get hit by this, right, Tamara? You're fine. You're fine. Nice. There we go. Okay, I want to see if we can get this kill with... Uh... Actually, no, I won't be, I won't be able to because he'll enemy phase. I was I wanted to get it with Fogata, but whatever. So we bought and shield Akris. We're chilling. Yeah, who's who did, we, who did Leaf come from? He came from Brodia, right? But, like, who does he belong to? Who's the cannon... Oh, that's fine. Who's cannon for Leaf? Honestly, I don't remember. I genuinely have no memory. Nice dodge and dead. There we go. Apologize later. Only one more life. One more life for Leaf. I was someone to talk to him with a leer, but like, dude, I'm completely blanking. What the? Zero damage. Oh, it's only if I initiate. I see. That's the only time I get that eclipse brace. 
But actually, now that that happened, we can actually get the uh, this kill uh, with Fogato. Here we go. But yeah, I'm honestly blanking on Leaf's uh, cannon user. Does he actually have one? Because we got didn't we get him from? No, we got Roy from King Morian. But like, didn't we get Leaf and Brodia too? I honestly have no memory, dude. I'm I'm completely blanking. I feel bad. If there's a cannon ring holder for Leaf, I honestly forgot. It's kind of sad, honestly. Alrighty, well, let's do this. That way, Tamara can get this kill. Here we go. Nice. And Ignis. Oh, huge damage. Now Tamara will definitely get this kill. Celine almost gets the level up, but not quite. She can get it sometime else. I want Tamara to get this kill. Here we go. Tamara, Fogato, and Diamant have put in lots of work in this chapter, mainly because I forced them to. <laughs> wow. Got hit by the 19. Sandstorm. Revenge. Does no extra damage because that's how Sandstorm works. There we go. Big EXP. Now they haven't fallen off. Get that thousand gold. We're chilling. Lance Agility 4. Nice to see. And yeah, we're chilling, dude. I think now we can come down with you, Naka. Hopefully not crit. Ooh. Honestly, you can crit me. I actually kind of want you to. Come on, Leaf. Crit me. Crit me. Nice. Diamant moment. Okay. Q. Crit me. Okay, just a hit. I really wanted you to get the crit. That's unfortunate. So we got Draconic Hex, and... Yep, that's it. He actually has that vantage, though, which is fine. Just took a quick look around the map. I did not forget anything. It is time for you to go, buddy. Here we are. I have been waiting. Are you prepared? I am. Of course, Leaf. I will face you anywhere, at any time. Then let us begin. A fair battle between equals. I see. That's what you're looking for, buddy. A fair battle. Well, you, uh, unfortunately, aren't really going to get one there because of that poor hit rate. Well, there we go. We defeated Leaf. Honestly, dude. Honestly. The chapter wasn't that bad. It was just tedious. It took me two hours, but that's literally, it was literally just tedious. Wasn't even that difficult. The ballistas at the start, yes, that, that was hard. But after that, free. You have become stronger since we first met, my friend. Aw, thank you for calling me your buddy. I feel like I've still got a long way to go. I appreciate your guidance. Guidance? An interesting word choice. What do you mean? I believe I understand now why the trial was located here. Oh? Why? I was a young prince, inexperienced in leading an army. My errors were many. Some fatal. How old is Leaf? I know Roy is super young being 15. Is Leaf also like 15 or like, probably like 15 or 16 or something. On the day of this battle, I was told something I've kept in my thoughts ever since. What's that? Once blood is spilled, it cannot return to its source. Make that sacrifice worth something. I see. Life is a series of choices. There is no way for one to know if their past choices were correct or a mistake. All we can do is make the future into something good and righteous. We must strive for that. Dude, Leaf is spitting facts. Now I want to play Thracia. <laughs> Such is the responsibility of a guide. And it is what I learned in the place so like this one. Thank you, Leaf, for sharing your story with me. I feel like I understand more than before. Honestly, all the emblems have, like, really good advice. I will work to build a good future. And you'll be beside me until the end of this war? Here. On the shores of this beautiful river, I swear my service to you. Aw. Thank you, buddy. Dude, that's so good. They're all, like, saying they'll be with Alir to the end, which scares me about the end, but still nice to see. Well, there we go. We did it. Leaf's Paralogue. Played for 72 hours. Wow. <laughs> Oh my gosh. I know of people who have beaten the game in less than half that time. Oh my goodness. All right, first things first, we definitely have to check out. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. This area is so pretty, but we have to look at Lee first. We got to see if he gets any better. Come on, surely get some better skills. All right, after 10, he gets Strong Bond, Vantage Plus. All right, Knife, Precision 3, Build 5, Light Brand. So we get the Light Brand. Luck plus 10 is not bad. That might be good on Ivy, honestly. <laughs> and it's magic. That actually might be good on Ivy. Maybe Leaf and Ivy. Hmm. All right, we got Arm Shield as well. And then Vantage Plus, Plus, which is, wow, okay. 75, that might not be bad. Honestly, maybe on Ivy. He might not be that bad on Ivy with the Light Brand and the Vantage. Interesting. 
And the build, too. That could help against, like, heavier tomes. Huh. Well, then. That's not still... That's still not, like, super good, but, like... I don't know. I just don't think he's, like, stellar. Like, it, it just sucks, because, like, Corrin has so much, right? She has, like, Draconic Hex, the ability to freeze people in place and adjacent units, and has that stupid fog, and has, like, the Torrential Roar, which is, like, can do all of that, but within, like, three spaces. It's just, like, Corrin's so stupid, dude. And then you look at Poor Leaf, and it's like, what does he have? Vantage, dude? Like, Vantage is good, but unless you have, like a really, really strong attacking unit. Like, you're not going to be able to Vantage in one shot. Like, maybe in another game, Vantage would be good. Well, maybe Vantage Nos. Hmm. Maybe Vantage Nos Feratu, but, like, that would only work on, like, armored units. Also, what is this? A seagull again, dude? Another freaking seagull? Kaka, bird! Seagull! My little sister threw a bagel at a seagull once. <laughs> I don't know why. Alrighty. Uh... But, yeah, this area is so freaking pretty, dude. So freaking pretty. Also, I've just been, like, thinking about Thank this game a so lot. Much. And, like, just, like, how it compares to, like, three houses. Because I think when I started doing YouTube, I did three houses, right? I did a whole huge playthrough of yes. three houses. Which actually, like, got a decent amount of attention. Not, like, nothing crazy, but a decent amount of attention. So... And, uh... Just, like, my experience with Three Houses, I feel like I've been having a more right. pleasant time with this game. I do think the Three Houses story is, like, a bit more engaging. Mm. I don't know. I, I'm not, I say that with no pun, of course. But, like, honestly, like, the Sorry. story is, is still fun. I still really enjoy it. People are always saying, like, oh, the story of Engage is mid. Hang on. I guess definitely, like, a little cliche and cheesy here and there. But I kind of like it, dude. I'm kind of a fan. However. And, uh... Just like my whole experience with this game has honestly just been more oh. fun gameplay wise than Three Houses. Because the Three Houses gameplay, while fun with like the gambits and all oh. that kind of stuff, it's just like this game, dude. This oh. game is just so deep with the combat. And I love it. And all the characters are really fun. And I feel so bad for not like using oh. some of these characters. Like I said, I think I want to make like a God File in the future. A uh, God File being where I just basically build every character up and make them broken um obviously Hi. whenever i do like future dlc episodes when they release i'll have like this file wow. that doesn't have all that but i'll have like a god file off to the side that i might show off for like uh spirit of the cards when i when i do like ether not ether it's like you know the, the tempest trials and like th that that kind of stuff for like other content but when it comes to like just doing Let this playthrough proceed. I won't use any like over grinding god files but if i may the god file will be good for other types of content Either way, I just really want to, like, almost do, like, an Iron Man or just something so I can show off all the other characters. Because, like, I feel bad. There's so many characters that I want to use. I just didn't get the chance to. Utterly astounding. You conquered the trial, and now I feel a new power within me. Thank you. No, thank you, Lee, for having such a beautiful-looking, freaking background. And look at this, dude. The water is so such a pretty blue. The grass is so nice. All the mountains surrounding. It's like, dude, this literally, these landscapes look so clean. So pretty, dude. Like, I could honestly just look at this. Like, if again, like, if I was a kid, dude, I would appreciate this for so, so much time. Uh, I almost wonder, like, what it's like to grow up in an age where these are the types of games you're playing and not, like, limited hardware games and whatnot. Because when I grew up, I was playing on, like, the PS2, the DS, the Game Boy, the Wii, that kind of stuff with, like, limited hardware. And now kids today are growing up with, like, PS5s and... Big ol' Xboxes, PCs, and uh, the, the Switch, of course. And it's just like, it's just, I don't know. It's just interesting to think about. A stunning performance. I'm impressed. I suppose fishing isn't all about results. Good catch. Nicely done. I suppose fishing isn't all about results. I suppose fishing isn't all about results. Good catch. Nicely done. I suppose fishing isn't all about results. A stunning performance. I'm impressed. A stunning performance. I'm impressed. I suppose fishing isn't all about results. You are going to eat this orange right now, Sommel. I hope you liked it, you silly dog. Great job! I'm so proud. I did garbage. Just what I'd expect from the Divine One. I think it's 90,000 for Triple S. Gosh dang it, dude. I'm always like right outside of it. I play like decently well every time though. I don't know what's wrong. Are you ready to watch a massacre, everybody? It's time for Fram's training. The thing is, Fram this is, my chance to shine. is good, but fight so hard that we start a legend. She's also bad. Yeah, um, yeah, yeah. Whoa, 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 whoa! Okay, you're, that's I'm you're crushed, doing good damage against Amber. You look really cool. Oh. 
I did it! Poor I Amber. Won. Poor, poor Amber. Just garbage. <laughs> Fram, 33rd steward of the Divine Dragon. You got this, maybe. I am Zelkov. That is all you need to know. Uh, you're maybe dead, actually. Nope, you're fine. Wow. Huh. Man. This been a battlefield. I would be slain. With that silver spirit out, she's actually not bad. I won. Maybe I should leave that on her. I always had it on Alir, but maybe she needs it. One more time. I'm a lot stronger than I look. What about one of Let's our try not to hurt each other, okay? Ooh, no, you're dead, John. You're dead. <laughs> it's been an honor sparring with you. Poor I, kid. I did it! I won. <laughs> oh my gosh. Poor Jean. I was hoping she would fight uh somebody uh from our current team to see how strong she could be. But whatever. Got plenty of bond fragments, which is awesome. And now we can do a little bit of cooking with oh, the train. Welcome. I shall do my best to prepare a wonderful meal. Yes, that's exactly what we're looking for. Goodbye, Chloe's meal. I'm gonna go for Citrine and Alfred here. I really wanna see their A support. I know I already reached uh, A support with Alfred, but I wanna see Celine and Alfred's after we give them a peach cake. Shall I prepare a three course meal? Or just a peach cake. A single dish, is it? I'll start by, wait, is this right? Do you know what you're doing? <laughs> I wonder if this will suit your tastes. Is it good? A hearty meal. Tastefully presented. It's evident that a chef put a great deal of care into it. Okay. A solid meal to build solid muscles. Sweet. The one person to actually say a line and not have to... Okay, well, all right then. Why are all my meals trash, dude? Where are like the A's at? I think I've gotten maybe one A this entire playthrough. Your cleaning skills are impressive. Well done. The ring shines like new. I'll ask for help again if the ring needs cleaning. How is it? Is it clean now? Can you make it shut? That's fine. Will that, will that? Yes. Is it clean now? <laughs> Wonderful. Good work. I'll ask for your help again. Thanks for taking care of this for me. How does it look? Oh, it's all shiny now. How did this ring get so dirty? Please remove, please remove. That bit was, it's extremely clean now. Thank you. <sighs> What fine care you've taken. Show me the A support between these two. Come on now. Ah, not quite. All right, all right. At least we have this thing to make it a little bit easier since I benched Alfred. <laughs> if I don't use meals, there's no other way. Surely one between these two soon as well. Uh, not quite. Not quite. Also, Lapis isn't lead this time. Wow. Catch up, buddy. You can do it. I guess it's not really a race. These two, surely. Come on now. There we go. Finally. Curious to see what they're going to finally end off their support with. Now keep watering those plants. <laughs> Who's it gonna be this time? Let's find out. The world's cutest is here to wake you up. Rosado, hello. You're a picturesque sleeper, you know that? Picturesque, huh? Actually, I should draw you. Not while I'm sleeping, please. For posterity's sake. He's actually doing it right now. Okay, I'll then. just make sure I've got the cheekbones right. And there we go. Okay, that was fast. I'm up. Hi. <laughs> Good morning. Hello. Oh, this? A little sketch I did of you sleeping. I think <laughs> I'll put it up in the cafe. Don't do that. Oh, why not? <laughs> That's embarrassing, buddy. <laughs> He's just like, oh, well, I'm sure this is natural. People just draw you in your sleep, divine one. <laughs> People watching Alir sleep is definitely not something new. Let's get some Bond conversations in here. See Doll and Roy. What do you got to chat about today? It was our destiny to fight beside one another, Roy. To celebrate, I'd like to show you a dance. I'm honored, See Doll. I'm told you're a superb dancer. At last, I get to see for myself. Nice. I mean, that's pretty simple. Seems like a lot of these Bond supports are just like... I'd say the majority of them are just kind of like... Funny character does their funny thing and the emblem's like, yeah, that's cool. <laughs> What about these two, though? It's an honor to fight alongside you, Sigurd. I've heard you're a hero who faced great hardships. This is true. Yet my friends helped me achieve much in my time. They were heroes as well. That's right. The friends gotta help the protag. That's just how it works. Oh, I guess Sigurd dies, so maybe they weren't much of help. <laughs> That's so mean. All right, here we go. A support between these two. I already thought they had it, honestly. I worry about you, Yunaka. Sometimes you seem to be forcing yourself, trying too hard. Maybe a little bit. I appreciate the concern, Corin. You're not wrong. There are times when I put up a front, but that front is just as real to me as the person I am underneath. 
and it's who I choose to be. Okay, I'm glad she said it outright, because I, I was saying it's like earlier, even though it's a bit of a facade, it's still the facade she wants to be, I guess. She's like choosing to be the person she wants to be by putting up the facade. I don't know, it's like fake it to make it, sort of, I don't know. I respect that choice more than I can say. If it ever gets to be too much, please lean on me. That's nice. Friendship. Yay, the power of friendship. Level 20 gives us deep synergy. That's cool. Now I can recharge Corrin even faster. And looks like Clan and Fram are our only support, so let's see what their A support's about. Mm. You okay, buddy? After that embarrassing moment? Okay, Clan. Spill it. What are you sulking about? Isn't it obvious the pamphlets? I can't believe I was too chicken to hand them out. I don't deserve to call myself a fan. Clan. Does every fiber of your being course with passion for the Divine One? I mean, yeah. <laughs> you know that. Oh my god, it's so stupid. So, there you have it. You're a fan, plain and simple. But, but... Being a fan isn't about what you do. It's about what you feel. If you've got that sweet, dragony passion in your heart, you're a Divine Dragon fan. Huh. Yeah. You're right. You're right! Honestly, yeah, I mean, I guess that applies to all things. Yeah, I don't know if that's like, people are gatekeeping being a Divine Dragon fan, but I guess there are gatekeepers into, you know, fandom stuff, so... It's good to hear this kind of stuff. If you like something, you're a fan of it. It's simply that simple. And you know what? I'm gonna try again. I will pass out those pamphlets. Let's go, buddy. That's the spirit! But first, I think we better make a few changes. What, right now? Right now? You said it yourself. Being a fan is about passion. Where's the passion? <laughs> we should write about our experiences with the Divine One, so our enthusiasm comes across. That's better than the shoe size, honestly. There aren't enough illustrations, either. Let's ask for help from someone who can draw. Well, oh dear, Rosado's painting is coming in. <laughs> and the interview needs... more. We didn't even ask if the Divine One prefers red or blue. Ooh. Well, probably blue after what he found out recently. Wow. Look at you, all motivated and stuff. That's the hardworking brother I know and love. These are going to be the best pamphlets ever. President Clan, let's get to work. It would be my honor, President Fram. I still don't know why you are both president. Are you Okay, well, whatever. <laughs> you guys are the presidents of the club that only has two members. Good for you. Anyway, that's going to be it for me. Thanks for watching, everybody. We'll probably do one more paralogue in the next episode before we continue with the story. I just want to get as much of these paralogues done before we get back into the main story. Because I want to like leave the last few episodes just right in a row. No more paralogues, right? Either way, that'll be it. Thanks for watching. I'll see you all later. Have a great day. Bye-bye.